We're here with Will Zimmerly and Connor Frenfrock of the Calutheran men's track and field teams to talk about the upcoming season. You guys are both returning student athletes who have seen the program grow over the last few years. What can you say have been some of the bigger strides you've seen from 2014 coming into 2015? Um, well, I know for the sprinters' sake, uh, we a lot of us were in the weight room this summer, uh, doing a lot of lifting, doing all the exercises that uh, Coach Holmberg had us doing. And uh, as for the fall, we've just been out there consistently, just uh, warming up, uh, stretching out, just getting our good foundation and base underneath us, just getting us ready for this season. Uh, I feel the same way. I feel like a lot has changed. That we've worked more in the fall. We started lifting really early this year, and that's something that I haven't done um, in the last two years. And we've been out there for the throwing events. We've been throwing since the beginning of the school year, and just putting in the work as early as we can. So it's good to see that. And well, you just touched on the throws group. Can you tell us what to expect from that group this spring? Yeah, I'm really excited to see what everyone does. We have a really young, strong core. Uh, we don't have any seniors. We only have juniors down. So um, expect to see a lot of improvement from last year and then carry that into next year. I think that's what we're all looking at. Connor, you have and will continue to play multiple roles on this team. You run some of the shorter sprint races as well as the relays. Can you give us a little bit of insight on both of those areas? Sure, yeah. Um, we have a lot of good pieces. Uh, we have Chu Aguager for, he's a sophomore this year. He's a good 400 meter runner and he's going to play a good piece on both relays. So he'll be good. Uh, we have a lot of kids coming in from football this year, like a bigger influx than we've had in the past, so that'll be a good contribution as well. So I definitely think that this year will be really competitive, even on like the national standpoint this year. And then on the track, you're going to have a strong core of distance runners as well, and they're mostly crossing over from cross country this season. How will that preparation help you guys in the spring? Yeah, I think that that will give us just a bigger base this year, and uh, I think that that will give us the ability to just be a more thorough team. Uh, we have Garrett Baker that's coming out, um, again, off of a good cross-country season. Uh, Ryan Perez had a good one this year, too. Uh, David Avila. So, I mean, we have a good, consistent base of uh, distance guys that I think will just give us a good competitive advantage when coming to uh, league meets. Yeah, it's, uh, it's good to see them coming straight over from, over from cross country and they're already in the mindset, I feel like, and they're helping us translate into that mindset. And then in addition to the throwing team in the field, what should we look for for the rest of the field events, jumping and so forth? Sure. Um, yeah, we have two uh, football kids coming out this year uh, on the guys' side. Uh, that will be good pieces for us, uh, Michael Whitey and Jalen Hall, so they'll be really competitive. As for the girls, we have Mary Case and Amanda Hamilton, so they'll be good as well this year. You guys are just a few days away from opening your season. You're going to have some tiff stuff, um, sorry, tough competition throughout the course of the season that's going to help you in Sky competition. What are your overall goals and expectations for the team this spring? Uh, I think just to grow, first off, grow closer together as a team and then just help each other compete. Um, I'd like to see a lot of cheering on of other people throughout the entire meets and just help each other. and. Of course, it's always nice to win at Skyak meets. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I feel that too. I think our bond will be a lot better this year, considering we've been working out uh, pretty hard in the preseason and in the early season. So that'll be good. Uh, I hope that we uh, place uh, a little bit better than we did last year. We were pretty competitive last year, but I think this year we'll have enough uh, base to set us over the edge this year. Gentlemen, great. Thank you, and best of luck this spring. Thank, Thank you. you.